Good morning everyone! Finally we have arrived in Prague. Just dropped off our luggages, the big ones, but I'm still carrying some. The check-in time, the official check-in time is at 2 and we arrived at like 10. So they could not let us in at the moment because the lady are still cleaning. Right now we are walking to the old town square to have a look and like probably like grab something to eat as well. And yeah. That's it for today and then go back, maybe like take a nap or so. We came to the post office in um, Prague at the moment. It's like five minute walk from our um, place and I got myself some stem and a postcard so I'm going to write it and send to Australia yet again anyway um, this this place is super nice so beautiful the same in when we were in Slovakia as well like the decoration the architecture was so nice so after this we go going to walk to the old town square and take some pictures here we go Wait, which one international? Done. my cousin I literally could not find her I'm not sure if she's in Sarah or she just walked away I was looking at the, the bricks like it is such a nice idea you know to paint a brick to uh, to put this food memory into like on a physical item and it costs quite a lot 18 krona or 7 euros or in Australian dollar it's like what 10 Australian dollars which is quite expensive for a brick but like you know when you come here you want to celebrate the good memory so you do one I don't know what to do I just have to wait for her here and um, by the way do you know why I'm wearing a jumper? It is 16 degree at the moment, even though it is summertime. However, it's still early in the morning, it's like 10.30. I'm waiting for the sun to come up like really high so then we can get like some sunlight and stuff. And I go back and change to another outfit. Currently, we are in the center of a shopping district. I'm not sure what it's called, but I will let you guys know um, in the description or on the screen. <laughs> Look at all the kids having fun. I want to do that too. So we legit spend like 15 minutes here just to film and take photo of the bubbles. Um, right now we're trying to find some place to eat. My cousin's like, can we eat Korean? I was like, oh, Asian food again. Korean restaurant that has a good review um, but they open at 11.30 and right now it's like 11.10 so we still have 20 minutes to fill the gap and we're just like walking around you know explore the alleys and the uh, buildings around the city center I have to say guys from the first impression Prague already won my heart like it is so beautiful
we were just doing you know some random walk just to fill up the time before we go to lunch and we have stumbled upon this beautiful market the traditional local market and like the scenery is quite beautiful and yeah we decided to come here again it's great for photo guys So we just bought some magnet, 5 plus 1 or 5, you get one free for only 100 krona or 4 euros. We didn't change any money so we just like give them some euros, get rid of the coins. And it is such a good deal, you know. I'm gonna show you guys real quick. What did you just get? Uh, panting. Three of them for three, uh, wait, 300 for, wait. 200? <laughs> no, three paintings for 100 krona, is that right? No, 200. Wait. <laughs> Three painting for 100 krona. What is it? So I was right. Three. <laughs> Three, painti three paintings for 100 kronas. That was such a good deal. Um, color painting, I'm not sure what kind of technique that they use, but um, I can show you guys real quick. Look at how many tourist groups there are, like along that way. It's like all the way there as well, like heaps of them. I mean, we are tourists as well, but we are individual, not in the group, you know. We just finished our lunch. Right now we're on our way to the hotel that we booked. Lunch was nice at the Korean restaurant. Um, it cost us 510 krona, which is around um, 33 Australian dollars. I paid by card, so the exchange rate was nice. And also, um, it's full of Korean people, no like no other tourists and no locals in there. So you know it's a good Korean authentic um, dishes when they like a lot of Korean people go there and eat. Anyway, I am still hungry. <laughs> Even though their portion is quite big, but yeah, for some reason I, I can I can eat more if you give me something now. And yeah, we're going back to have some rest. It is 1 o'clock and our room is not ready yet so while we're waiting I have to go and take some money out because they don't accept credit card We have to pay for the tourist um, stay in Prague um, 1.2 euro for two of us um, I'm not sure how much is that equivalent to um, the Corona but We'll find out soon so we finally got our room. This is a hostel. We decided not to go and spend a lot of money because we're only here for one night. Well, we're here for one night for every country anyway. But here, this is a good place to walk to the train station and close by to a mall, everything as well. So yeah, this is the room. Just like one bed on each side and then that's it. We have a shared bathroom and yeah. So we're going to take a nap now for like two hours and then we go out. Again. Okay, okay, let's check out the view. What? Big window. Oh, it's nice. Guys, I, 
overslept. I'm meant to take a nap for like half an hour to an hour, but now it's four o'clock and the sun is setting, it's getting cloudier and cloudier and right now the sun is running out and we have changed. Look at my cousin. She all dressed up and everything and my shirt is all scrunched up from the all the you know the squishy from the luggage. So right now we're trying to find a good spot to take some photo um, with the museum and you see the sky? It's like it's about to rain but it's summer. I want my son back. It's raining like crazy at the moment, so we are seeking shelter in H&M. Um, but you know what, my cousin is browsing, so we might get out with something as well.